Hey everybody, Coach EJ here. And I'm Christian Aguilar. And in today's lesson, we're gonna be going over defensive slips. Now guys, uh, on the previous videos, we showed you offensive slips. And now we're gonna show you a way how to, how to be a little more defensive with this as well. You will have opportunity to still uh, bring forth some sort of offense, but uh, for, for the time being in this defensive movement, we're really just trying to get out the way. Okay, now to start, we're gonna start off with our stance. We're gonna bend our knees, step back, hands are up. And now what we're gonna do, just like before, we're trying to get off center line. Uh, slips are generally for jabs, uh, jabs and crosses, and sometimes even upward. All right, but it's for any time we're trying, they're trying to target us down the line. So now all we're going to do now, we're going to hinge at the hip. It's basically like doing a side crunch, and we're pushing this hip out. Like if I'm going to my right side, pushing the hip out, coming to the right. If I'm going to my left, I push my hip out to the right side, coming to the left. Okay. Now one of the key things here is to make sure our knees are bent. And a common mistake that you're going to you're going to see or, or find is. A lot of people try to attach their head to the ceiling. And what I mean by that is they always want to kind of keep their head upright and it puts them to this weird motion. All right, you gotta let your, your head go with your body. Okay, now in this instance as well, it's not gonna take as long to do these. I can do these a lot, a lot quicker than the other ones. Kind of have that Mike Tyson feel for it, okay? So now if I have my partner here, uh, Christian coming in, he's gonna throw a jab cross. Okay, I'm gonna come out the way, come out the way. Now he's gonna go a little faster. A little faster. Okay, let's go on, just push. Okay. Same thing, guys. Okay. Now, we're gonna start naming these as well. Like, just like we numbered up the, the offensive slips, we're gonna number these as well. All right, so, when he throws the jab and I slip out the way of the jab, this is gonna be number three. And when he throws across and I get out the way, number four. Okay, so again, three, four, three, four. Three, four. This will be relevant down the line when we do our partner drills and the numbers will come into play. All right, guys, I'm Coach EJ, and that's the defensive slip.